Today's podcast is brought to you by the letters L T T. This is Debbie Jones with Learning Through Technology. After you've created your class, you will want to add students to your class. So go to the left column, click on My School, click on Students, and the student names will appear over on the right, just as if they were in an Excel spreadsheet. You can sort the students by last name or by grade just by clicking on the column title. I'm going to do it by grade. I think it's a lot easier to find my students. Now, if it were just one or two students that I were going to find, was going to find, I would click down here in this field and I would type in the student's last name. I can also have this page show me more than 20 students at a time. If I click right here, I can get it to show me 50 or even up to 100 students at a time. So I'm going to set it to 50 so I can get more names on here. Yes, I will have to scroll to do this, but that's okay. It makes it a lot easier for me. It is still um, showing me primary and I selected third grade for my students. So what I'm going to do is go over here and jump over a few pages and see if I can get to the third grade level. That's first. Second seems like every other one gives me another grade level. And that's four, so I must be right on with page nine. There we are with third grade students. So you will have to click on the pages down there to find the grade level that you need. And then find the students that you want to add to your class. Put a check mark by their names. And when you finish checking all the ones that you need in your class, then you're going to go up and ask it to add to class. And that's found under the Actions button. So you click Add to Class, and you will need to select the class name. So you may have more than one class. At this time, I just have one class, so I do need to click on it to select it. And then I click Add, and those students will now be added to my reading class. If I want to see if that worked, I can go up here. I can see there's my class. I chose reading class. And when I click on that, all the students that I had put a check mark by will appear in the reading class. And that's how you add students to your class in Compass Learning Odyssey. If you have an idea for a future podcast, please send it to yourcharlotteschools.com slash askchrispress or you can send them via email to askchrispress at gmail.com. Thank you.